What is apatite? Apatite is a group of minerals that share a common chemical composition and crystal structure. The name apatite comes from the Greek word apate, which means deceit, because the mineral can easily be mistaken for other minerals. Apatite is a phosphate mineral, meaning it contains a group of chemical elements that include phosphorus, oxygen, and other elements such as calcium, fluorine, or chlorine. Apatite can be found in a variety of colors, including green, blue, yellow, brown, and purple. It is typically transparent to translucent and has a vitreous or glassy luster. Apatite is widely distributed throughout the world and can be found in igneous, metamorphic, and sedimentary rocks. It is often associated with other minerals, such as feldspar, mica, and quartz. Apatite can also be found in biological materials such as bones and teeth. In addition to its beauty as a gemstone, apatite is an important mineral in many industries. For example, it is used in the production of fertilizers, as a source of phosphorus for the manufacture of chemicals, and in the manufacture of toothpaste and other dental products. Apatite is also used in the field of medicine. It is a component of some antacids and is used to treat hyperphosphatemia, a condition in which there is too much phosphorus in the blood. Apatite is also used in bone grafts and other surgical implants, as it is biocompatible and can aid in the regeneration of bone tissue. Overall, apatite is a fascinating mineral with a wide range of uses and applications. Its beautiful colors and unique properties make it a favorite among mineral collectors and gemstone enthusiasts, while its versatility and importance in various industries make it a valuable resource for many applications. What are the features of apatite? Apatite is a group of minerals that share similar features. Here are some of the key features of apatite. Chemical composition, apatite is a phosphate mineral, which means it contains the chemical elements phosphorus, oxygen, and other elements such as calcium, fluorine, or chlorine. Crystal structure, apatite has a hexagonal crystal structure, which means that its atoms are arranged in a repeating hexagonal pattern. Hardness, apatite has a hardness of 5 on the Mohs scale, which means it is relatively soft and can be scratched with a knife or other sharp object. Color, apatite can come in a wide range of colors, including green, blue, yellow, brown, and purple. Some varieties of apatite can also be colorless or nearly colorless. Transparency, apatite is typically transparent to translucent, which means that light can pass through it but it is not completely transparent. Luster, apatite has a vitreous or glassy luster, which means it has a shiny, reflective surface like glass. Cleavage, apatite has a good cleavage in two directions, which means it can be easily split or broken along certain planes. Specific gravity, apatite has a specific gravity that varies depending on the specific type of apatite mineral, but it generally ranges from 3.1 to 3.9. Occurrence, apatite can be found in a variety of geological settings, including igneous, metamorphic, and sedimentary rocks. It is often associated with other minerals, such as feldspar, mica, and quartz. Uses, apatite has a wide range of uses, including as a gemstone, a source of phosphorus for fertilizers and chemical manufacturing, a component of toothpaste and other dental products, and in medicine for treating hyperphosphatemia and aiding in bone regeneration. How is apatite formed? Apatite can form in a variety of geological settings, including igneous, metamorphic, and sedimentary rocks. Here are some of the ways apatite can be formed. Igneous processes, apatite can be formed in igneous rocks through several processes. For example, during the crystallization of magma, apatite can crystallize out of the magma along with other minerals such as feldspar and mica. Apatite can also form in volcanic rocks when magma cools quickly and forms glassy rocks called tuff or pumice. Metamorphic processes, apatite can also form through metamorphic processes, 
which involve the transformation of existing rocks due to changes in pressure, temperature, or other conditions. During metamorphism, minerals can recrystallize and reorganize, leading to the formation of new minerals such as apatite. Sedimentary processes Apatite can also form in sedimentary rocks through several processes. For example, apatite can be formed in marine sedimentary rocks through the accumulation of shells, bones, and other organic matter that contain phosphorus. Over time, the sediment can be buried and undergo compaction and cementation, leading to the formation of sedimentary rocks such as limestone or phosphate rock. Biological processes Apatite can also form in biological materials such as bones and teeth. In bones, apatite forms a mineral component of the bone matrix that gives bones their strength and hardness. Overall, the formation of apatite depends on a complex interplay of geological, chemical, and biological processes that can occur over a wide range of time scales and conditions. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications.